Yo, what is good, everybody? We are here at the Rubicon. I'm pretty sure everybody and they mama knows about this track right here. This is also where the famous debate was held of pop versus soda. And we'll tell you boys right now, it's soda. All right, leave it alone. Let it go. It was three years ago. It's soda. You guys lost. Are right? you pop and fizzy guys? You lost. All right, it's soda. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I still get comments to this day. What was that, three years ago now? Three, almost four years, we made that video uh, where her was like, all right, chat, everyone comment right now, pop or soda. And, it, and when he said that, bro, he has sparked the battle of a lifetime, all right? <laughs> anyway, we are here at a very monumental track. This is also where Snake is very good at. If you guys know who Snake is, the OG in the Reflex, uh, in the GP, across the games. So you know, he's just an OG in the Dirtbag community, man. Shout out to my boy Snake, man. We always had some amazing battles here. We've ha always had amazing battles here, period, with anybody that came and rode here. We had some just straight up dog fights here. It's always been an amazing uh, battle or something going on at this track where we just battle for freaking laps on end. Or sometimes the guy that's up front just better that day. He's long gone. You know, it can go either way. But as you can guys already see, this track is beautiful. It's amazing. Very fast paced, huge jumps, a lot of sexy ruts, man. Uh, I like how it like forms a rut and it breaks off and the rut comes back as dope. You gotta watch out for this corner right here because it will get you, bite you in the ass because you might flop, you know, flop the track. Um, but, I mean, there's nothing mu much else I can say about this track. You guys already know this track is amazing. I just wanted to bring it back, play it, relive it. This is my first lap on it. Uh, and I don't know how long. It, it's, it, it has to have been a year since I played this, at least. No, I'm just saying a year because I might have played it, you know, when I came back for a little bit. Actually, you know what? I think, I think, I'm gonna go ahead and say it's been about two years since I played this track. It's been a very long time. Because I'm pretty sure the last time I played it, I think Snake was playing with us. And I don't remember the last time Snake even played Reflex. Oh, I know it, I lied. He did come by for, I, I believe, one race. For the uh, wild wild wilderness, oh my god, y'all killed me with the damn name. The wild wilderness series that uh, Red uh, hooked up hooked up for us with the Arena Cross tracks, uh, which, like I said, my I think in my Green Hills video, uh, I was talking about how Red's uh, Red makes really good, you know, ground information uh, for his tracks. Uh, those tracks are amazing, by the way. If you have not ridden those tracks, you should go check them out. Uh, and ride, ride them with your buddies because they break down, and when they break down, boy, does the track change. Um, I get this fat triple. This triple takes lives, boy. I, I can't tell you how many times I've tried to, like, you know, cut a little bit more off that corner and I case that and just died in the lead or died right behind somebody. Man, you just got the mess out of this. As you can see, this is a very, very long track. <laughs> track long as hell, boy. I believe C. I think C. Ford told me that he talked uh, Jamie T into putting that corner there. I believe it was C4. So shout out to C4 for that nice Talladega or mini Talladega uh, corner right there. Oh, I didn't, I didn't even say who made this track. I'm so sorry. Jamie T, the legend, made this track right here. Jamie T is a well-known legend, well-known god in the reflex community. Uh, so, you know, you know, you know, when his name is said, you make sure you bow your heads. You know what I'm saying? Show respect. You know what I'm saying? Put some respect on it when I speak Jamie T words into the atmosphere. You know what I'm saying? Let's go outside. Let's check this out right here. But this track... It's just it 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 aged very well. It it that's what the hell this. Oh, remember scrubbing this was kind of like life or, life or death. Oh, there it is. There's a the death. <laughs> Cause like you can do that or you can not make it. You know, it's just scrubbing that jump was always sick, but sometimes it could uh, it could kill you. And then you can send this downhill. Tissy send this. What happens here? Ah! I'm alive, boy. I don't play, boy. I'm not Hugh Hefner, but um. Yeah, like, as you can see, this track is like heaven for throwing scrubs, fat whips. Let's throw, let's throw, let's throw a nice big... Oh, Willie, though, no! Damn it, man. You just throw some nice big fat scrubs and whips here, man. And it just... It made for some really amazing high-speed racing. Like, as you can see, I'm, I'm literally... I got, I got RT literally, except for this corner right here, obviously. I got RT just... Freaking clap, bro. RT don't never come up for no no for no man on this track, bro. The RT stay down, bro. Oh, except right there. Ah! Oh, look at that. My reflex skills are coming back. But uh RT, for the most part, 
is just clapped on this track, all right? You never let that RT up. That right trigger, be like, let me up. Like, nah, B, we drowning your ass today, boy. <laughs> Look at these ruts, man. Like, how old this track is, the ruts on here are amazing. Cause like, as, you know, as track creators kind of, you know, evolved, I guess you could say, or just got better making tracks, the ruts got better. And as the ruts got better, you know, people kind of, you know, I guess spread the word or work together on helping other track creators make ruts, you know what I'm saying? So the fact that these ruts are these are, 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 are this good, for how old this track is, it just shows you, you know, what what level Jamie T was on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I think when this track came out, you know, Red Rider had made his first Supercars track. You know what I'm saying? And let's just, let's just say, you know, Red, I love you. I love you, Red. Let's just say, <laughs> Red, like this motherfucker. <laughs> let's just say Red came a long way. You know what I'm saying? Even though I like this first track, that scrub though. Red has come a long way. And I, I feel like Red be killing the game with his ruts. And so the Dark Slides of C4, you know, Garrett 64, or KTM 6060. KTM, I always mess up KTM name. KTM 6060, you know, they make amazing ruts now. But like, you know, this at the time was the best ruts in my opinion. Like there was nobody beating these ruts right here. Um, I don't know if I made like a, I'm pretty sure I made a, a, a single, like a single video on this. But I know that my multiplayer video is what uh, got the most traction. And rightly, right, rightfully so. It was an amazing race. Uh, I would like to, I would like to race Roman here one of these days. Roman, yes, I'm shouting you. Out. I know I'm gonna lose, but Roman, you know, I'm an outdoor guy. You know what I'm saying? And look, 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 look. I know Roman used it. Look, look. I know Roman used the damn Joker lane like five times in a race. But look at here. I beat Roman at Loretta's. All right. I got that one victory. And I, also, I, I got a few other ones. Or a couple other ones that I didn't post because they were just shitty wins because I think Roman just kind of messed up a lot and, and a win is so I didn't post them but you know he posts his on his own channel you can go watch that on Roman's channel all right I beat him at Loretta's all right I beat Roman one time you know what I'm saying I redeemed myself <laughs> but uh, I was always pretty good here I think I think my best track is Glen Helen though I don't know why I I I, I haven't really lost too many times at Glen Helen I remember we we're doing that uh that outdoor championship uh, White Wolf was just whooping my ass at every track, but I beat him at Glen Helen both motos So, you know what I'm saying? That, that just shows you, you know, Glen Helen is my track I don't know about now, been in a while, but you know back when I was, you know what I'm saying, when I was good at Reflex When I was real good at it, um, uh, Glen Helen was my track But I was always pretty good at Rubicon as well, man I love Rubicon to this day, to this day! <laughs> to this day! Let me stop <laughs> But uh, I'm going to end it here on this this last, or this next, or this next time we cross the finish line. So this this lap here we ended on. Um, but Rubicon, bro, you age very well. You're still an amazing track on an amazing game. Uh, right now playing this, I, I still know why I prefer this over Supercross games. Like, let's this, this, this be real though. The Supercross games are getting a lot better. I know people want to heavily d disagree with me on saying that Reflex is better than the Supercross games. I know they're like, bro, what? Bro, what? But yeah, Reflex, I don't know, man. It's old, but damn, I love it. I still, I st I, st I don't know. I guess just, this is how people like all out. I guess I, I click that same way with this game. Cause there's, there's kids out there that are so good at all out. And I, I just don't even want to play that game that much to even get that good. But when it comes to, you know, games like Reflex and Sim, I will give it that time. But I guess, I guess, you know, I guess I'm old school. I guess I'm just like, you know, those guys that say that old games, Halo 1 was the best, you know, you know even, even though it may not, I don't play Halo, so I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just giving an example, but I'm gonna bounce off that, hit the inner rut, ooh, I still got it, y'all, I still got it, um, I guess I'm just that old man, you know, back in my day, Reflex was the best game, I know a lot of you guys are younger kids, you know, you guys really like the new Supercross games, and they're, they're good, I'm not saying that this game is way better. I just, I just the way it feels, the way I scrub, the way I maneuver on the track. You know, it just I, I understand this game. You know, I can ride like I do. I'm not this fast in real life. That's not even close to that. But I'm just saying I can ride it like I would if I could in real life. You know, setting up for corners, flying into them. You know, hitting the rut, bam. You know what I'm saying? Taking off. That's a kind of a bad corner, but just this track right here gives a gives me the or gives you guys the best example of why I love Reflex because I can just ride this shit. Balls to the wall, scrubbing stuff, throwing fat whips, you know what I mean? Grabbing ruts, grabbing berms, like hella hard, and just hitting them and, you know, and just killing the berms. That was a bad whip. I'm gonna do it. Let's actually hit this, uh, this step up here one last time. And that's when I'll call it. 
but yeah, I'm so glad I came back and played this, man. It just uh, definitely brought me back to them old, them old reflex days, you know. All right, here we go. I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna get flat. This dummy flat. Ooh, what a oppo! Oh, can we save it though? Oh, we good. We good. We straight. All right. That being said, though, boys, that is it for me. I will catch you all on the next one. You guys all have a wonderful day, a wonderful life. I'm out.